Hello, I'm James Clark, the executive chef here at the Carolina Inn. Today we're going to do one of our dishes that's off of our dinner menu. Uh, and it's going to be an asparagus salad. First off is I really like to get these pretty little small tender asparagus. And I'm going to drop them right into some salted boiling water. Just like that. Real simple. And let those gently poach uh, for a little bit until they are cooked through. And while those are going, we're going to swing right over here and make our jar dressing. What I like to call jar dressing. Which is real simple. You put everything in the jar, you shake it up, and it's dressing that's in a jar. <laughs> so I've got a little bit of shallot and garlic that I'm going to put in there. Some Dijon mustard. Some basil and some tarragon and some parsley. I'm going to put right in there like that. All right. Some capers. And a little bit of grilled scallion and some diced red pepper. The colors are beautiful. All right. I'm going to add some sherry vinegar. And then I'm going to add some extra virgin olive oil. Gloop, gloop, gloop. All right. And the great thing about this dressing is, is that you can make a whole bunch of it and it'll keep for about a week in the, in the refrigerator. And then you just shake it up. So we're going to go right back to our asparagus. And when you're cooking green vegetables, it's always important that you put, blanch them in that salted water, but then immediately pull them out and put them into some ice so that it'll stop the cooking and cool them down rapidly. And then I take them, pull them out, and let them drain. Let's take our asparagus. And I'm going to season them with just a little bit of pepper and a little bit of salt. All right. And put them right there on that plate. Kind of stack them a little bit. I'm going to take some of my frisee greens and some of my jar dressing. See it right down in there? Doesn't that look great? I'm going to take a little bit of that. I'm going to spoon it right over that, frisee. I'm going to spoon a little bit on top of my asparagus. Put that right in the center. I'm going to garnish it with just a little bit of our pickled spring onions. Like that. And then I'm going to finish it with a fried egg right on top. And there you go.